Hello and welcome to another episode of the KB series of my channel. This is where I'll be explaining some basic computer networking terms and tasks. The ones that I think are useful to know in order to understand the main videos of this channel better. And in this video, we're going to see how to position the antennas of a wireless router in a one story house for optimum coverage. Wireless routers or access points usually have omnidirectional antennas, which means that when the antenna is positioned vertically, wireless signals travel in all directions horizontally, creating a shape similar to that of a donut around the antenna. Now if I position the antenna in this way, the coverage area will change to a pattern that will not be optimal for a single story house scenario, which could lead to a weaker signal strength or even no signal at all in certain areas. In fact, I conducted a little test and with the help of a Wi-Fi analyzer, I checked the signal strength of the 5 GHz band in two different locations, once with the antennas positioned vertically and once with the antennas positioned horizontally. In both locations, I received stronger signals when the antennas were in a vertical position, and as I moved further away, the difference in signal strength became more and more significant. So essentially, in a single story house, it is best to keep the wireless router in a central location, elevated above the ground and at a height that is typical of where client devices such as laptops or smartphones are used. If the antennas are external, it is important to make sure they are in a vertical position which can help maximize signal strength and coverage. In the next KB video, we're going to take a look at this topic, but focusing specifically on multi-story houses. So don't forget to subscribe for that. But until then, thank you very much for watching this KB video. Please hit that like button if you liked it. And don't forget to check out other KB videos. Thank you again, and I will see you next time.